My guess is you're underinsured. Like 83% of Australians are underinsured. And since 2001, the consensus is each year that about 80 to 83% of Australians are uninsured. So you're underinsured. And what are you gonna do about it? Probably nothing. I'm trying to change that. I'm trying to get the message out there that there is a way to try and reduce your risk of underinsurance when it comes to property valuations. We need change. The way it's been done doesn't work. So if you continue to do the same thing, it doesn't work. I've voted with my feet. I just changed our insurance for our, um, for our house insurance for that very reason. When I took out the policy, they didn't even ask. They just said, What's, what are they insured for? What do you want to insure it for? And I come up with the number. They didn't ask where that came from. Have you got it independently done? They didn't know I was a quantity surveyor. So I changed. I walked away from it. You have to take responsibility for yourself. If your property burns down or is flooded and you're underinsured, the, what's going to happen is you're going to have to chuck some money in yourself. Now, I couldn't think of anything worse than my property burning down, losing all of my life possessions, dealing with the kids and all that sort of stuff. And also taking a phone call from the insurance company saying, hey, you need to chip in an extra 30K or 40K to rebuild your house. I could think of nothing worse. So you'll be underinsured and you'll continue to be unless you take action. And by doing that, you need to get some advice from an independent person and an expert in the industry. Otherwise, keep on using your online calculators and stay part of that 83%. For more information, visit our website at mcgqs.com.au.